All right, here is my final update for my Kilo Company, 3rd Battalion, 5th Marines, 1st Marine Division, Operation Imperial Lake impressions. So December 1970 to February 1971. Um, it's changed quite a bit. I made a couple videos on it throughout the years, but it's basically done now. So we'll start off with the rifle. This is my reworked um, JG M16A1. It's now an XM16E1, except for the A2 slip ring or delta ring and the trapdoor buttstock. So I shaved off the fencing. Uh, looks fine. Put a dimple on the fire selector uh, switch on this side. Now it has a chrome bolt carrier group. Um, three prong flash hider. And I also shaved off the JG logo. So yeah, um, I also added an original sling on there and it looks okay for right now. It'll work. So we'll go to the uniform now, my ERDO fatigues, my uh, blouse. I have my um, dog tags from when I was in the Marine Corps, just like uh, the other video. Uh, sea rat toilet paper and a chew hoy bag. Old bicycle playing cards and a chew hoy bag. Electrical tape. 550 cord. Um, cigarette case. Zippo. Church key with a P38. 1963 dated camera. Bug juice. That's basically everything I carry in my pockets. My trousers. I have a modern uh, trouser belt that went on my dress blues. I have a modern Buck 119 and an original scabbard on my trouser belt. 70s wallet with some MPC money in there, currency. And a Buck 110 knife. This one should be, I think, 1972 dated because of the... Uh, the rivets right here are the dots. Over here I have 1965 dated third pattern jungle boots. So really early, uh, really early production. These are CIC. Pretty cool. I have uh, boot bands on there and then I have original socks in there as well. Next to that, I have my 8 point. This is 1984 dated, but it's still the same material as the Vietnam ones. This one's pretty beat up. 1968 dated skivvy shirt. Or 67 dated. Pretty cool. Over here, I have my helmet. It's got a different cover on there and a Korean War era liner pretty common to see i don't have a rubber inner tube band on there right now even though i have it um later on you see less and less of them being used so i just don't have it on right now over here is my 55 black it's 1980 dated yep I have a original colt 20 round magazine with a couple rounds in there right now Sea Rat Spoon. So yeah. My wet belt. The first pattern pistol belt, first pattern canteen covers, jungle first aid with some stuff in there, just bandages and the later war uh, insect repellent. Canteen in here is from 1964. This one's from 65. I got the canteen, canteen cup in there right now. M7 bayonet with M8 scabbard. Above that, I have my second pocket bandolier with original Adventure Line magazines. The camera wants to focus. You can kind of see it, but they have uh, some rounds in there right now. There's an original Claymore bag 
with the instructions still intact. The original idea was I was gonna put spare batteries in here, but I just never got around to buying the batteries. So it's kind of there for, you know, whatever, magazines, canteens, smoke grenades, whatever. Here's my M17 gas mask with bag. See, it's the correct one, not the A1. Over here, I have my towel. And then I have two dummy grenades on top and a watch that I uh, wear. Over here, I have an Arvin rucksack. The reason I have two packs right here is because it's optional if I wanted to put the radio into uh, the Arvin main pack, but I don't really like to do that. So it's kind of there just to show that this is another setup option. This is my NOS one with the uh, frame. I have a couple of these if you watch my, uh, my rucksack or pack collection video. But this one's just there, kind of for show. There's my PRC-77 radio with M41 Haversack. So I have a H189 handset. This one's uh, new old stock as well. There's a Korean War M41 Haversack. ERDO poncho liner underneath that is a signal flare. My PRC 77 or 25 accessory bag, which has the uh, the other antenna in there. On this side, I have a violet smoke grenade and a high concealment smoke grenade. On the PRC 77, I have the 10 foot tent pole antenna which is common to see uh, in the mountainous region that the 5th Marines were operating in at the time. And all of it is on the PRC-77 or 25 uh, harness board thing. But yeah, um, I'll show you guys what's inside now. All right, here is everything in my haversack and kind of how I pack it. So on the outside, I had signal flare, um, my poncho liner. On the inside, basically all on the bottom uh, are socks. And then around here are my sea rations. So we got turkey, ham, B1 unit, B3 unit. It's a ERDL boonie, skivvy shirt, my other 1967 dated one. Here is the u collared px shirt 67 dated popeye book with uh chew Hoy bags the rest of my chew Hoy bags under that is an original uh toothpaste old toothbrush with carrying case my rifle cleaning kit with rifle bore cleaner and yeah that's basically it and then again, on top of the pack, smoke grenades, um, handset, antenna, accessory bag, and then it's all on the uh, ST-138 harness. Yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching.